Are they alpacas? That's not a sheep. Yeah, I think they're sheep. from the Cleveland Metro Park Zoo. Yep, the zoo reopened uh, in June, late June, and we've had quite a summer, so we've never really done videos this summer. But we are back, and as you can see, the zoo is open, but it's requiring face masks. So we are being safe and following the zoo and the city rules help stop the spread. Yeah, so the zoo is requiring a face mask uh, and it looks like everybody here is really wearing a face mask, so that's great. Um, we did come to the zoo a couple of weeks ago uh, when they first opened back up and uh, it was kind of sparse. You know, some people were wearing them, some people weren't, uh, but now there is a mandate that everybody has to wear them in the city, in the city uh, wherever they are in a public place. So uh, right now it looks like everybody is wearing them and, and everybody's staying safe. So it looks to be good. We'll see how it is as we go around. Um, I think that was the kind of problem last time that we were here. Yeah. When we went around, it wasn't really being enforced. So we'll see what happens there. But uh, we're gonna go around, we're gonna check it out. We'll let you guys know what's going on and um, we'll kind of, uh, you know, be able to. Uh, and they also have a new dinosaur X section so we'll be on the hunt for that yeah we're gonna search for that uh dinosaur um it's a special, uh, ex it's special like event it's right. that all the time and right now they are having the uh asian lantern uh festival and so in that, that's in the evening so we're not really going to that but we'll be able to show you guys some of the stuff that they have uh around the zoo so well, let's go in let's kind of check it out this is the monkeys Back there, you can see one right up there. Yeah, they're back. They're just kind of chilling up there at the top. There he is. Yeah, I reckon there's more back there. You see? Lincoln's having trouble finding the monkeys. They're kind of blending in. Yeah, everything is blue. See those ones back there? They have white, but they that makes it... a white tail. Come with us on our ride along in the zoo. The cruise to zoo. The cruise to zoo. You would recognize that this is the area where we couldn't actually see the new rhino enclosure. And so this is the new rhino enclosure. And right now I don't see any rhinos. This guy, he's probably over here in the corner. He likes to hide in the shade. But this is the new rhino enclosure here. So we'll see if he's hiding over here. Because last time we came walking in the zoo. Last time we walked in the zoo, we saw him right in this exact same spot. <laughs> or he was there up he again. Is. A big rhino. I'm going to fold up. I'm just power. chilling in the shade. Like got a nice big nasty. enclosure. But he likes to chill here in this shady area. Here. You want to see the rhino? Because he doesn't like the sun. Because he doesn't like the sun. And so here is the old enclosure that they're still using, but uh, there's the other rhino. The females and the babies. I think it's two babies and one female? I think it's two babies, yeah. Well, they're looking pretty big now. It's nice. I don't know what it is. They just like to chill in that back corner. I wonder if there's like air conditioning in the building. Oh yeah, that's, that's true too. And as you can see, they have 
signage, you know, telling people to uh, stay safe, make sure they're keeping social distance, washing their hands, face coverings are required. And here they have a uh, hand wash station. So the zoo is kind of keeping up with that stuff. And this leads up to uh, the Asian area where you can be able to see most animals from Asia. Okay, do we want to see additional habitat or tiger view? We can go through the tiger. Let's go to the tiger viewing. As they're going through the line here to get up to the viewing for the tiger, we found a little butterfly. Zoo chipmunk. He is not even moving. He's coming right up to us. <laughs> and there is the tiger. Look at that big paw. Yeah, they have a lot of stuff for enrichment that they can walk around and do. You see him? Oh. It's That's nice pretty cool, huh? And it just kind of hangs out up there and lays out. Oh boy, he's coming right up to us. Wow. Now if that's not a view of a tiger, I don't know what is. Zoya! Oh. It just comes right up in your face. Zoya! Hi, Zoya! And this is just awesome. Right in your face. So big as me. Like a big kitty. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh-huh. What? Sure so you don't. So they he knows exactly what I'm talking about. So they brought the donkeys out. Uh, she say that I call them something other than donkeys. I'm not, not sure for that. I'm not sure if that's uh, true at all. <laughs> but we're gonna head up here and hopefully see some sea lions. And there's the sea lions. We found them. We have a nice little spot here. Set up like a pool. Is that cool? Got a little ball to play with? Mm -hmm. And as you can see, out here they have social distancing markings yeah, so that see? people will stay six feet apart Look, right while watching. Oh. It's really nice today. We're really getting to see all of the animals. Not too hot, so they're kind of, they're coming out. So looks like he's just going to go ahead and take a seat right there. This is just really cool. Getting to see all of the animals today. Sometimes you catch just a few, sometimes you catch them all. And now we're coming up into the Asian Highlands. Um, but I believe that the snow leopards and the cheetahs, oh there it is! It's not a cheetah. It's not a, a cheetah, a leopard. The animals are all out today, what? I think it's uh, not as hot. Yeah, I mean just a great day to come to the zoo. It's really cool to be able to see them. Yeah, the snow leopards are 
see one they are now. You see one? Oh, there it is. I don't see. You can see his paws up against the... So as we were having such a good day seeing all of the animals, my favorite, the red pandas, are nowhere to be found. Except probably has died. But they are my favorite. And this is their enclosure. And this is about as close as I can get to one. I don't know, it looks like a baby bear. I mean, well, not like a baby baby, but do you think it's just a little bear? I don't know, you guys leave a comment down below if you know anything about bears. What kind of bear is it, Landon? But that looks like an Andean bear. We'll see how big Andean bears are, but it doesn't look that big. So to me, it's probably a smaller bear. Or it's just a little one. Or it's just a little bear. Yeah, and Maybe Andean bears are just this big. Up to the reindeer the section. They're in the pool. They're in the pool. Look at the baby reindeer. Maybe they are gearing up for Santa sleigh. So we packed a lunch and we're at a table, socially distanced. Are you boys having fun today? You having fun? Yeah. Having fun? Why aren't you having fun? Oh, you are having fun. You're just trying to trick us. So the plan is after lunch, we're going to go see the giraffes. Yeah. And then go see the dinosaurs. Yeah. Nice pet. I got that on camera. Oh, did you? Nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Sunglasses keep falling out. So we have our tickets for the dinosaur exhibit. Like we said, it is an additional cost. For members, it's two dollars. For non-members, it's three dollars. Um, there's also like a wristband you can get that is eight dollars for members. I think I don't know what it is for non-members. That is for the carousel, the train the 4D theater and the dinosaurs. So if you want to do all those things, that's definitely the better deal. Um, we also found out for the Asian Lantern Festival, the dinosaurs are free. So you don't have to pay extra if you come to the festival um, when it, at night. So are we ready to see some dinosaurs? Yeah! And super, super cute. Lincoln asked me while we were in the uh, restroom uh, if the dinosaurs would bite. Uh. No, so no, they're not going to bite. You don't have to worry not. about that. I hope not. I hope not. I hope they don't Let's do it. Right. Let's go. Here we go. All right, here we go. Going to see some dinosaurs. Let's go. Get that giant. <laughs> Disney uh, fans will understand that reference. If they rode How cool is that, Lincoln? Oh, look at that big mouth. That is pretty cool. Yeah, 
Look at those tiny arms. Oh man, look at this one. Look at that lava. Oh yeah, that Spinosaurus is in the with the Jurassic World oh, movies, it isn't it? Oh, there it goes. It's waiting for us. Spinosaurus. So Lincoln, Lincoln's not that comfortable with this situation. <laughs> Oh, I think if anything, it's telling us he is not ready to ride dinosaurs. No, not ready for dinosaur yet. Premium. Oh, premium look at this one. Oh, we didn't even notice this one. Me neither. I didn't notice this one. Uh, Are you okay with this one, Lincoln? It's a little baby dinosaur. Yeah. It's the big ones that are scary. Hey, Rex. Kensosaurus. This Kensosaurus? He's an herbivore, so he only eats. He only yeah. eats plants. The other ones we saw were her was meat. Keeps those spikes, I'm sure, to keep predators away. Yeah, I would love to be with this guy. Yeah. He's a horrible boy. He's playing. Oh. Europosaurus. Oh man, doesn't it look like one of those turkey vultures? Oh, what is this? It's a herbivore. It's a herbivore, huh? Okay, with this one? No, it's a herbivore. It's a herbivore. It doesn't eat plants. Oh, he's a plant eater. He's a plant eater. Look, see how he's rummaging in the plants? He's looking for something good to eat. That's a little cool one. Mom, he's so cute. Oh, I know. Her parents. Protosaurus. He's so cute. <laughs> He's so cute. Cryolophosaurus. Cryolophosaurus. It's another smaller one. Uh, but it says up to 21 feet. 21 feet long. Found in Antarctica. Look at this giant guy. Oh, oh. He looks like he would be. That's a micro. He eats fish. Micro. Probably rat. dives right into the water, huh? Coming up. Emerson. Oh, here's one. Look, look at this. Oh, he's so cute! Wow. He eats herbs, Lincoln. He is big, but he eats rats. He's a plant eater. He's a plant yep. eater. And, and here's their favorite. I'm so glad they're happy. Look at this one. It's your favorite dinosaur. You like the Triceratops, Lincoln? I don't, I don't like him. I love him. <laughs> Dakota Raptor. It's just so an animatronic. Like at Disney, the animatronics like at Disney. Oh, yeah. Remember? Yeah. Did you he hear him legit scream? Uh-uh. <laughs> he actually screams. Yeah, 
Dinosaur exhibit uh, continues this way uh, to the gift shop. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, wait, there is one more. Oh, my goodness, oh. look at this big croc. Oh, my. It's not a crocodile. No, you're right. It's a dino supus. And it eats grass. I mean, dino it eats. Dino supus. And it it's a carnivore. Wow. Here's the eyes look like a Wow. Um, then they have the little gift shop set up. It's got the little bitty. Oh, look at those little plush dolls. Look, triceratops. Those little plush triceratops. Oh, those are like those little things that go around your wrist. Oh, yeah. Of course, you're asking to get one. <laughs> He's hugging on to you with We caved. Mine is hugging on like We have no willpower as parents. <laughs> so we are, we are out of the dinosaur exhibit. We were just talking about it. it's really cool. Yeah. And totally worth the eight dollars we spent for the four of us to get in. Having the membership, getting uh, the discount, and being able to go in and go through and see all of that. And you guys have already seen it. Uh, but uh, it it's was cool nice because it's all animatronics. I, I thought it would be just steel dinosaurs where you just go through and just look at like the mannequin of it or whatever. And um, it was better because of the animatronics and it had all of the info about the dinosaurs and stuff like that. So I thought it was really, really neat and, and, and cool for the two bucks that we spent on each ticket. Yeah, and they like, they seem to essentially be life-size, like what scientists believe that they were so it was really cool to just like sort of be in the presence and i mean they were lifelike enough that lincoln was terrified right, of some exactly. of them so long story short come to the metro park zoo and do the dinosaur exhibit before it closes so right now because of trying to keep socially distanced and stuff the only way to get up to the deck is if you buy lettuce to feed the giraffe. Um, we've chosen not to do that since we just bought dinosaurs. Mm. And, and tickets for, to see. Yeah, so we're gonna just check out the di the giraffes. I almost said dinosaurs. Check out the giraffes from here. Cause we've been in the dinosaurs. And it actually, it looks like it would have been a waste of our time anyways, cause they're walking away. They're probably yeah. a little full. Oh, the joys of trying not to touch anything. So this is the wallaby walkabout. See the train? Oh, 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 gotta run, gotta run. <laughs> bunch of wallabies over here having some lunch and this cute little guy so some of the exhibits are closed because of the virus most of the indoor things the um, slide Play area is also closed for obvious reasons. We don't need kids touching things. So Landon's trying to jump as much as a kangaroo. You made it about halfway. In this area, normally you can go in and pet the animals, but again, because of the virus. You can't right now. But they got, are those, are they alpacas? That's not a sheep. Yeah, I think they're sheep. Those? That's the pins for the sheep. 
Look, that's, a that, that's a goat, so don't but go off of sheep, right? Yeah, but a goat just came out of it, so that I doesn't understand. Necessarily... But there's goats coming out of that one, too. These are not sheep. Look at them. Oh, maybe they are alpaca. Thank you. Sheep don't have long necks like that. Well, I'm just saying, they got hair. The sheep must be inside enjoying some shade. And also, probably the horse and donkey. Yeah. The goats and alpacas are out enjoying some food. Yeah. We found the miniature horses. They're on the other side of the um, this barn. And again, normally you can walk in and go through and come like out this door. Um, because they have more like like stalls and stuff inside, but it's closed sounds up right like now. The, sounds like the sheep are in there. Sheep. Sheep. Yeah, they must be inside. Back. So, but the miniature horses are out getting some some sun and fresh air. So the European rabbit Europe. that is everywhere, but the very nope, top Australia. of Australia. No, is in. But this thing looks like a rack. It's right there. Totally blending in. When you look close, you can see its face. It does. It looks like a little rack. Mm hmm. Landon noticed these lanterns that lead to the theater and immediately, what did you say they are? They're the Great Wall of China. Nicely done, buddy. Before he even saw the sign that told him. Our little genius. Mommy. What? Maybe you should think um, Puppy Dog Pals. I should think Puppy Dog Pals? Because yeah, in one of the episodes, it showed the Great Wall of China. Aww. Disney yeah, Television okay. Entertainment, enter educating our kids. Look how big he is, man. Look at that big mane he has on. What did Daddy Do you think Simba him? looks like that? Do you think it is Simba? Uh, oh. And then he, and then, um, who what was the, his friend's name? Nala? Yeah, and his then girl, Nala. Well, wife by the yeah. end. So there's three elephants right there. And then look so you can over there. So we look at a couple boys. more. I think there's, yeah, I think there's five elephants total. Yeah, so I think two. that's all of them. So two. One male and four female? Yes. So this big guy right here is the male. So that is our trip to the zoo. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. What was your favorite part? The dinosaurs. The dinosaurs? What was your favorite part? The dinosaurs. The dinosaurs, the dinosaurs were your favorite Even and your favorite. Even though it was Yeah. Or was getting the special dinosaur your favorite part? The um, special part. Okay. <laughs> Both of the dinosaur parts. Getting the little dino and seeing the dino. Uh, it was a lot of fun. We got to see a lot of animals. And uh, hopefully we'll be coming back again soon. So then... Maybe the rainforest portion will be open, uh, but uh, it wasn't a problem with our mask. Uh, I didn't see anybody else without their mask on, and uh, I thought it was a very good day at the zoo. So, uh, thanks for joining us. Oh, if you liked our video, click subscribe. Click the bell icon to be notified when we upload a new video. Yes, click the bell.